Nine investigative team found nine break-ins reported at Red Dot Storage in Iowa City in about a two-week stretch. And that's on top of six other calls for things like suspicious activity and renters suspect more thefts are to come. KCRG tv 9s Libby Randall looked into this situation and found there might be a reason thieves are targeting this specific storage facility. That's right, Beth, Jim, that's what has victims so upset. It's the same reason we were able to just walk in today. The gate there is broken and has been for weeks. Renters say the owners knew it and didn't tell anyone or work to keep their items safe. Even before Molly Rossiter opened her storage unit at Red Dot Storage, she knew something was wrong. We were coming out Wednesday, August 9th, um, to put some more stuff in the garage. Uh, first clue was as we're driving up, I noticed the gate was open. I just assumed that somebody at that time, I assumed somebody had just come through. What you see here was left. Everything else, the most valuable items stored in the unit, were gone, worth more than $8,000. But the theft isn't what angered Rossiter and other victims. It's how it happened. The gate has been broken for weeks. We were able to just walk right in. The Johnson County Sheriff's deputy who investigated noted in his report the gate, quote, has been open and anyone can access the facility. Deputies have increased patrols. In an area like a storage unit or anywhere in town, it'd just be something that's out of normal daily routine. But that hasn't stopped the break-ins. Renters are demanding the owners do more to protect their property. You put your trust in a place like this. You absolutely feel violated. You feel um, disrespected. <laughs> you feel so many things that are going through. Even though it wasn't at my personal residence, you put your trust in a place like this. They knew these things were going on and they've done nothing to, to make amends. Um, mine wasn't the first report. I'm absolutely certain it won't be the last. The Johnson County Sheriff's Office is investigating the thefts but has not made any arrests. We reached out to Red Dot Storage for comment. As of this newscast, we have not heard back. In studio, Libby Randall, KCRG TV 9 News. All right.